And that's why after 24 debates, after 10 years, we're suing the Commission. The Commission remains inactive while the assault on our values, on our rights and on our money continues every day. Orban's family and his friends keep stealing our money. Colleagues, dear Commissioner Hahn, uh, today is the 24th debate on the rule of law, including in Hungary, since Viktor Orban was elected in 2010. Uh, 24 times we have discussed the dismantling of democracy, the attacks on the free media, on independent judges. And all these debates, of course, haven't stopped Orban from turning Hungary into a corrupt autocracy right at the heart of the European Union. First, the Commission looked away. Then the Commission said, we don't have the tools. Now you do have the tools, but you are not using it. The Commission remains inactive, while the assault on our values, on our, on our rights and on our money continues every day. Orban's family and his friends keep stealing our money. And you, Commissioner, you have said it again today, no case will be lost, suggesting that we have time. But we don't. In a bit over six months, there is an election in Hungary. And of course, the fate of Viktor Orban is for the Hungarian voters to decide. But we need to make sure that our EU money is not contributing to rigging or stealing that election. So the inaction of the Commission is highly political because your, elect, uh, your inaction allows Orban to buy support with EU money. Your inaction allows Orban to control the media coverage of that campaign. And your inaction makes that the opposition is not contesting in a fair and free election in Hungary. And that's why after 24 debates, after 10 years, we're suing the Commission. Because we don't want that the European Union supports the re-election campaign of a corrupt autocrat in Hungary. Thank you very much.